That's funny, convict. I don't recall giving you access to our database. Just keeping up on current events, Captain. Seems this Queen of Blades got everybody running scared. <laughs> she don't look so tough. You have no idea who she is, do you, Tychus? Don't matter to me none. Well, it matters to Jim. They were close once. Wait a minute. <laughs> You're telling me they were shacked up? Apparently she was something else. Before the Zerg took her. Turned her into that. And Jimmy feels responsible. Honestly, if we have to face her again, I don't know what he'll do. Woman like that, there's only one thing to do. Caught Tychus hacking into our database, sniffing around about Kerrigan. I don't know what his game is, but we clearly can't trust him. Matt, me and Tychus ran together a long time. Got in all sorts of trouble. When the law finally caught up, he took the rap for both of us. Never once ratted me out. I got a second chance, he got locked up. I understand your loyalty, sir, but... I owe him, Matt. Leave it be. Yes, sir. Guess you heard the news by now, Rainer. Looks like you're back in business. That I am, Mr. Hill. And fighting the Zerg and Dominion all at once is gonna take its toll on my standing forces. Guns for hire? But you know, the invasion makes it a seller's market right now. Still, your bartender over there makes a hell of a Mai Tai. So, sure, I've got some mercenary contracts you might be interested in. You're all heart, Mr. Hill. Alright then, welcome to the mercenaries. I will be trying to get every mercenary. Just can't let it go, can you? This is Donnie Vermillion live from UNN. Tonight, we're going to discuss the infamous Queen of Blades. Scientists and military insiders have long speculated that the enigmatic alien is in fact an infested human. That's right, Donnie. Is it possible that the leader of the Zerg has a human heart? More importantly, Kate, could this mean some kind of Terran-Zerg alliance is possible? Donnie, there's never been any evidence at all to suggest that infested humans retain their free will. You make a good point, Kate. The question is then, how do we kill her? That's one I think we all can agree on. If humanity is to survive, the Queen of Blades needs to be eliminated. Your Mobius buddies ever happen to mention that the Queen of Blades wants these artifacts too? Hey, he just give me the mission, man. What's it matter anyway? Putting that bitch down would be doing everyone a favor. I thought it was just about the money with you times. Nothing says I can't do my part for humanity and get paid, girl, for my trouble. Right. Alright, and this is the Marauder. Uh, no bio on him. Oh, going to the armory to upgrade. Upgrades. 
since I'm not going to be using the Marauder much, basically he's just, the Marauder is just a stand in. This one's, in, this one's important. Oh, hello Stim. How you have been missed. Are you alright, sir? Confronting Kerrigan again after all these years. We've got to stop her, Matt. No matter what she's after. Well, we gave her a setback today. The artifacts are obviously important to her. We just wish we knew why. <laughs> 